Hi there, are you considering relocating, buying a second home here on 30A, but would like to have a community that does not allow short-term runoff? Well, then this video is for you because today I'm going to explore three of my favorite communities that I have shared with buyers over the years that I think you will enjoy learning about. Hello and welcome, Sabina Robertson, broker owner of Seahouse Realty, serving buyers and sellers here on the Emerald Coast. If you ever have any questions about any specific communities, please always feel free to reach out to me. So let's go ahead and dive into my first community that I truly enjoy, and it is called Bellama at Golf Place. Bella Ma at Golf Place is a luxury gated community renamed from Golf Place neighborhood around in 2021. Located on the north side of scenic Highway 30A, just west of Highway 393, Bella Ma is a non rental community where short-term rentals are not permitted. I particularly love this community, probably one of my favorite ones because of the amazing location. It is gated and has its own deeded beach access directly located next to the view of 30A. Some of the properties in Bellama also are on the golf course, which really is a unique golf course by itself. Next, let's discover Rich Walk a Vandy Rice community that has some French styles homes, very different than Bellama. Rich Walk is one of the few no short-term rental communities as well, but it doesn't allow rentals of six months or longer. The prime location provides residents with a wealth of attraction and amenities, including a beautiful European style pool, and also Rich Walk is gated. The style of homes quite different uh, than the ones in Bellama, and it gives you a complete different feel. It does not have a deeded beach access point, but you are not too far from Ed Wallin public beach access. Lastly, let's take a look at Sea Dunes. Sea Dunes is located off Allen Loop. It's an older established neighborhood with a few newer homes popping up because there's probably only two or three lots left to build on. And the homes in there are smaller cottage homes and they are distinct because they all have a little white picket fence. Again, the homes in Sea Dunes do not allow short-term rentals. I hope you enjoyed the video about my three favorite communities here on the West End. They all have their unique styles and they're all a little different and offer something for everyone. If you would like more information on any of the community price points and um, please reach out to me directly. I'm happy to provide that to you. I hope you enjoyed the video. Until the next time, auf Wiedersehen, tschüss und goodbye.